my lovely TTs, welcome back to the channel. Popular reality TV star, love and hip hop star, Erica Mina decides to make this video and post it onto her Insta story yesterday of her going off on her baby daddy, Safari. So let's go ahead and get into what happened. Safari decided to announce that he has this charity for Jamaican kids, okay, kids in Jamaica. And he wants to give back to these kids due to the hurricane that recently happened in Jamaica, okay? So he announces this charity and this sets Erica Mina off, okay? She decides to make this video and she's like, hold on, how are you giving back to other kids when you're not even doing anything for your own kids? Now, of course, Safari is on child support because I was like, hold on, why don't she just put him on child support instead of, you know, making these videos and trying to expose him? But he is on child support, but she still felt the need to make this video to not let people get scammed. That's what she said. Anyways, let's get into the video. <laughs> buy this waste man overnight wannabe profit this individual has no idea that his children has have actually started school yeah your daughter is officially in pre-k and started yesterday and here i am feeling guilty because i wasn't there due to work and while i'm feeling guilty they're trying to make the world believe that they actually have a charity because they care about other people's children. How can you care about anybody else's children when you don't even care about your own? You miss out on birthdays by choice. You miss out on Christmas by choice. All because you think missing out in their lives makes me suffer. Wake up call. I could fill in for you at any time and I've proven that. But your non-existence in my children's life does not make me miserable. It actually has helped me progress so much. But now you're on the internet playing with my kids because you don't even do for them unless it's something that's taken out of your little measly child support. I gotta sit back and watch my kids literally suffer already as it is because you're their daddy while you play with other people's children and you don't even notice that your daughter has started school yesterday and you probably could have been the parent to fill in the void and at least made it so she had one of us in the building for that big moment don't be scam y'all no way in hell this man cares about other people's children when he doesn't even acknowledge the existence of his own and i'm gonna just leave it right there because this man loves to run to the police and claim that i'm bullying him so we'll leave it at that but don't be scammed and don't be fooled because literally my kids go months and months and months at a time without this man even asking if they need anything or if they're even alive. In fact, when his homies ask how their kids are, his very statement is, I haven't heard anything. I guess they're still alive since they're not on the news. That's the type of man y'all dealing with. So, y'all could believe this, but remember who y'all dealing with. This is the same man that literally runs from doing anything for his own children. All right, so that's what Erica Mina had to say about her baby daddy, Safari, starting this charity for kids in Jamaica. She feels very disappointed that he's not there for his own kids starting school, but he wants to help out these other kids, okay? And honestly, it does seem like at this point, because wasn't it said that Safari did something for another cast member, like when he was dating, I think her name is Amara or Amara, or, I don't know her name, but... I remember when the story was going around where he gifted her kids with like two rollies and the kids were like babies, but Erica Mina spoke out and she was like, you don't even do for your own kids. So at this point, he's doing like 
so another thing like this and of course it's starting to seem like hey you're doing this on purpose okay because you do have kids why not make sure that you're there for your kids but i think at this point what safari is showing is that it's going to take time for him to grow and mature and be able to be a part of his kids life that he has with erica mina because he has so much animosity and pain from the situation that happened with him and erica mina that he doesn't even see himself being a father to their kids which is completely sad but i bet you there is a lot of men who can tell you that they go through this same exact thing where they have so much animosity towards their baby mother you know what i'm saying and they are holding a grudge they're still better that they can't even really treat their kids right now as for erica mina like i said we kind of know girl like she's saying in the beginning of this video you not being a part of our kids life it doesn't affect me it's not making me miserable because at this point of course people have told her but she knows that it seems like he's doing this on purpose to make her upset okay and they both do things to make each other upset but yeah she's saying like this doesn't affect me but we know that it does you wouldn't be making this video if it didn't you would let that man be let him do whatever he's doing and come to peace with your situation because this is a man that you chose to marry and this is a man that you chose to make your baby daddy and i understand that it's an unfortunate and that situations happen where people get divorced and you don't expect for people to cheat on you i get it life always happens to all of us right but at some point she has to come to terms with her situation at some point safari has to come to terms with the situation that he has two kids with erica mina step up and be that father that you need to be for your kids okay but it's obvious like i said i'm not giving no excuses to nobody because i do understand why and i will say this erica mina was getting a lot of backlash after she made this video because people felt like she wasn't being sensitive to the kids in jamaica like she's only thinking about herself and she's only thinking about her kids so she was getting backlash people was bashing her but then again you have to understand that it's disappointing as a mother for a man to constantly show that i'll do things for other people's kids and everybody else's kids but i don't necessarily want to do anything for my kids okay but erica mina has to understand that both of them are bitter at this point now if you haven't watched love and hip-hop you know what i'm saying if you don't know what happened between erica mina and safari i would love to play it here but for copyright reasons i can't i suggest you watch that okay because you would know where things went wrong between safari and erica mina and at this point it seems never ending but i hope at some point for the kids sake i always felt like in baby mama and baby daddy trauma when situations happen like this i feel so bad for the kids because i'm like the kids don't deserve this all this drama going on between mommy and daddy because it does affect them you know that's the thing that really does affect them so the best bet would be for them to get along and erica mina has tried from what i see but safari i think she has to understand safari is very very upset okay and i do feel like in a way erica mina be poking that bear she be poking at him okay and i understand she's doing it for her baby cubs she's doing it for her children but then she do gotta cool out she has to come to terms with her situation that she has with safari she said that he's on child support in this video so it's like what can you expect unfortunately you know but she's she's exposing him every chance that she can get if she wants to do that that's up to her she has to understand that her kids are going to see mommy and daddy going back and forth and all this drama at some point okay so you don't want to continue it and keep it going for years to come okay like i said hopefully things get better between these two okay nobody wants to always hear the erica mina and safari are getting into it or erica mina is coming for safari or safari is not doing for his kids if you have to get counseling do what you got to do if you got to step up and do what you got to do for your kids just do it also i want to bring this up and then i'm going to end this video because it's beginning to be quite longer than i thought it would be but erica mina if y'all know she recently did an interview with cam newton and i was going to do a whole video on this right and then cam newton asked her about dating and she's talking about oh if production wasn't in my business if it wasn't in my relationship my marriage then i probably would have still been married and then she takes 
a long pause and a sigh you know and she completely forgets the question and she's like rambling and cam newton asks her again okay what about dating so it seems like in a way she was basically saying that she does miss some things about safari or maybe she cannot find you know another man who wants to marry her because maybe everything that she has going on i don't know but for her to do that sigh like she missed safari after it's like you are continuously bashing this man so do you want his attention do you want him to be there for the kids or do you want something else do you miss you being with this man i, I don't know i don't know what's going on between these two but y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section once again thank you so much for watching room for tea make sure you like comment and subscribe to my channel turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time i upload i'll see you guys in my next video have a blessed rest of your night